we, we are at the Val Dam today basically to talk about what the impact of the recent rains has been, especially on the Val River system where we know that uh, we've got 14 dams that feed into the river system. But obviously, looking at the Val Dam as, as a simple example, we have seen that it has risen between Friday and today uh, from about 44.4% uh, capacity to 52.8, uh, which is quite significant for a weekend and a couple of days. And therefore, this has been a, a highlight for us. On, on, a, on a normal, during a normal year when we have good rains and everything, is fine. When we look at that uh, um, um, uh, structure, concrete structure, and you look at the, the level of that brown that is almost halfway up that, that structure, that is when it is actually at its best. And at that time you'll see everybody who has boats around here, uh, you know, they'll be out on, on the river and people will be doing all sorts of recreational uh, activities on the, on, on the water. It implies that at the time there is security of supply, especially for uh, power generation, for Sasol, as well as for every other industry that is around uh, Gauteng and other parts. But what it does not mean is that South Africa is out of the woods with relation to uh, the drought. And obviously what we are also asking is that people will continue to use water wisely, adhere to the water restrictions where they have been imposed, and obviously uh, uh, remember that South Africa continues to be a water scarce country.